let's talk about the custom templates. So these are basically templates that you create yourself and later on you can use them whenever you want to. Now let's create our first template. It will be to create an article for how Google these have of work. I've prepared a prompt that we are going to use when creating that custom template. Okay, before we will dive into it, let's find this feature in Neural Writer. So in order to find it, you click AI Writing tab, then you go custom section, and here are the templates that have been created already. We are going to create a new template, so let's click on new template button. Perfect. This is how it looks like. Firstly, let's give our template a name. SEO expert explanation. Then we have internal description. Let's have a long form article. Moving forward, system role. This is also optional. We have got it prepared right there. So let's copy it and paste it right here. Below you have variables that you can use when creating your prompt. We will select them in a second. I just want to copy that prompt first, okay? And just paste it in a prompt space below. Awesome. Now, Let's read our prompt and select the variables that we have right here, okay? So you aim to write a long form article longer than 1500 words covering topic. As a topic, we want the query in the best possible way to engage sales. Use the basic terms and extended terms, okay? So let's select basic terms, extended terms to calculate the density of keywords in the article according to usage count. Forecast how to add terms to have the highest content score based on the terms density. As this article needs to be SEO and user intent optimized, please strictly follow these orders. Start with a click work with title proposal and explanatory H1 header where you use H1 terms. Perfect. Mm, H1 terms. Plan outline with 5 to 7 H2. Subheadings covering the whole subject using H2 terms. Awesome. In the first paragraph, after H1, use H1 terms. We've selected them already. And a few terms from the list of extended terms, we also have selected them already. To write a summary of the article, after each H2, plan three sentences in two paragraphs using basic and extended terms. We've planned them already with context to that H2 header. Provide output in a HTML, okay? This is our prompt. We selected variables. Now let's go to our prompt. Now, what do we do with these variables? Let's take them below. Okay, let's make space between each of them. Okay, and now let's copy the topic and just paste it right here. Okay, so the topic is our query, then basic terms. Okay, let's copy and just paste it right here. Okay, so I'm assigning each definition from this prompt to the variables. You will see why I'm doing it in a second. Perfect. And the last one, H2. Okay, perfect. Awesome. Now let's save this template. Done. This is our templates right here. This is the name of our template and the internal description. Let's click on that. And this is how it looks like. Okay, as you can see, Neural Writer already filled in all the fields for us, and the only thing needed for us is to click Write for Me button. But before we do it, let's see the preview of that prompt. Okay, so this is our prompt, and as you can see, the prompt includes now the variables that Neural Writer filled in for us. Okay, we have H1 terms, H2 terms, etc. Let's click OK. Now let's delete that and click write for me button. And here we have our article written for us. It's at 55%. Let's add meta title and meta description. Just using AI, save and close. It's at 66. Later on, if you want to edit that template, you can simply click on the note icon next to the name of the template. I hope it helps. That's all.